before I pray. Oh, um, my, not Jay, sorry. Uh, that's all right. Uh, let me say what, what a privilege it is uh, to share in this time of dedication of your church leadership. No, he bang in a Paul Pisunga, Makai de adding in a two get subtading Kahiman in a top end, Kayading in a Hunpa, Hunum Hatichi, and get Masanoming. This is a wonderful group of leaders, and any organization, including a church, uh, will rise or fall uh, depending upon the quality of its leaders. Ina hibang ina makai hoi makai mon hoi nei hi mani na nasia sama mahang kipol na khat lim lim pen a aka to dinga hi zong ina akhan dinga hi zong ina akiam suk dinga hi zong na tua khem pel pen makai te tunga kinga ma ma hi We typically think of Acts chapter 6 as being the story of when the church first established deacons or other leaders besides the apostles in the life of the church Paul bi masate tang thu en le hang sol tak alian guk na sunga Paul pi ke patchelina upa upa ki tel na mu theiding hiang In addition to their responsibilities to prepare and teach the word of God the 12 disciples 12 apostles were also trying to operate a food ministry to the many many widows that were a part of the church there in Jerusalem Jerusalem They obviously struggled with that huge responsibility because they some of the widows began to complain that they felt like they were being overlooked in the process and were not being properly served. And so the apostles called a meeting of the church and suggested that they select seven individuals who would serve as those very first deacons. Those seven individuals would take over and assume the duties for operating the food ministry. They did a great job with that responsibility because the ministry of the church greatly increased after they took it over. That story in Acts 6 concludes like this. So God's message continued to spread. The number of believers greatly increased in Jerusalem. And many of the Jewish priests were converted too. And so we see from the Bible that the role of deacons, the role of church leadership is to come alongside the pastor to assist with doing whatever is needed to help make the ministry of the church more effective. For each of you who have volunteered to serve in these positions, we are grateful. Thank you for making yourself available to God to make the ministry of this church more effective. Let's pray.